Hey, Danny Marie 911 here, coming at you live with some more Horizon Forbidden West. I did get new monitors in. My goal is to put them here. I got two 27 inches, and my plan is to move my PlayStation Xbox all over so everything's on my desk instead of multiple sides. It just hasn't happened yet. I'll get there. So, setup's coming. It's just a matter of time. We're still trying to decide if we want both desks in that room or keep one in here. He kind of wants to do both in one, but I'm concerned that if we do that and we're playing together, this volume might kind of be an issue with both of us side by side. But I do think we're going to turn this smaller room into my library and the bigger one into the entertainment room. That way we can actually put like theater seating in there, which would be pretty cool. At least I think so. Okay, where did I leave off? Oh yeah, we're going after Poseidon next. Okay, let's go get Poseidon. So last week I was out, but I had a lot of fun at the Oklahoma Renaissance Festival. I got my hair braided, watched some really neat shows, no upgrades, okay. I what you got? Was finally... Probably get a oh, guest list of 50. <laughs> At least three dozen kegs. <laughs> Brown ale, maybe. But no, no. For him, scrapper's up. <laughs> what are you planning? Are you planning a party? Budgeting for Moreland's funeral. Thanks to you. I really? Was this close. <sighs> we were going to move on. Leave all this nonsense behind, and you come along. <sighs> you spark your wet noodle idea. It works. I've heard that before. So, uh, how does someone like you end up working for someone like Moreland? I work with Moreland. We got three equal claims in this venture. Three. I saw one of his early shows. Back when it was just him and his inventions. Works of flame, lights, and shadows, all kinds of gizmos. Never seen the light. I'd like to see one of these shows. But the man is all spectacle. No sense. Bleeds shards like like you get the idea. Without me to handle the finances, his dreams would be sunk. More sunk. <laughs> Wish we were back in the claim. Well, if you're not normal shows to do without the the salvage from this blasted place. And yet, you're here, in the middle of the desert, delving for his dream. It was a good one. We'll make it happen. Sometime, that dream has to die. No, it doesn't. This dream of Moreland's... Is going to get him killed. Let's say it doesn't. <laughs> what happens after he gets the salvage down there? Then we put on the greatest show the world's ever seen. Where? We'll have, we'll have special seating, premium ale, the works. Moreland will do his his light spectacle thing. Stemmer will get their eyes a sparkling with his tails, and I'll be selling tickets. Sounds like it's your dream too. It's a nice thought. Moreland mentioned you were showman. What? An ostrom can't be anything other than a, a, a delver, tinker, or drunkard? <laughs> okay, sure, we are delvers too, but that is not our main source of income. Mostly, we go town to town, putting on shows. These shows, what are they? What happens at them? Tales and spectacle. I, um, Moreland's got the technical know-how. Builds uh, all manner of inventions, whirly gigs of, of light and sound, cannons that, that, that shoot fire and showers of sparks and stemmer. Keeps them enthralled. Tales of adventure in the smoothest baritone. Yes, I like his baritone. Yeah, that. And you? Me? Who do you think handles the financials for the whole blasted thing? <laughs> Those two, eh, those two might have the, the sparks, but 
Do you think they know their way around shards? <laughs> no, they don't. The one guy's face and voice makes me think of an actor whose name I'm bad with actors' names. So but. Moreland was down in this ancient city, and the three of us went down below. You? I can delve too. Right. And uh, <laughs> then what happened? What do you think? Water rushed in. We ran. And Moreland built that blasted thing. Now we got himself drowned twice. <laughs> you want the finer details of his stupidity? You go ask him. Rare. I'm always willing to engage in some commerce. What you got? Ooh, you got stuff I don't have. Okay, let's sell you the junk. Behemoth circulator for that. Let's go ahead and buy that outfit. And we're good. Okay. I'll leave you alone. Do us a favor. Leave us all alone. I'm about to make your dream come true, dude. Chill out. Ammo that deals adhesive. Fast moving enemies to build up slowed state. Yeah, I hate that state. favorite weapon thus far, so we'll switch to it, even though I can't find anything under the water, which sucks. Okay. So yeah, this guy, his voice, his face looks familiar. I do you like your voice? Okay, let's head down. So good. I can actually breathe down here. Yeah, we've already experimented with it, Chica. Hey, light, woo. Okay, not seeing much otherwise at the moment. Yeah, the mask seems to be holding up. I've never been able to swim this deep before. It's awesome. Wow, it's pretty under here. Let's see what we got. Data point. A star that right. Can I search? A star that right here, more than thirty years ago, back when this casino was still called the Temple. Casino. One big day, turned my fate around, but now. Great stuff to screw this hand ever to everyone. I have to turn the lights out one final time, and the waters of my adopted home will at last run dry. Well, if a dream has to die, at least I can say goodbye first. No, you're gonna help others' dreams come true. What is he doing here? Don't know. Las Vegas, May 4th, 2060. Twenty years ago this week, Stanley Chen broke ground on one of the most ambitious construction projects in American history, even though many Americans didn't want him there. As he struck his spade into the barren soil, the CEO quipped how resentment against Chinese political influence had turned Vegas into a boiling hotbed of nationalistic sentiment, but how his immense fortune had cooled that down, finally warming Americans to his idea of a new Las Vegas. Who would have believed at the time that he would become one of the most beloved figures of the clawback era? But Stanley Chin has always been one to defy the odds. Literally. In 2035, during a meeting with potential investors at the Old Tempo Hotel, Chin watched in horror as his water filtration startup drowned before his very eyes, realizing too late that his once-trusted lawyer had sold the critical patent info to the competition. 
The resulting chain reaction of busted deals wiped him out, leaving him with only $88,000 to his name. Devastated, Chen decided to leave his future to fate. He went to the casino floor and placed all 88000 on a roulette wheel. Number 8. It hit, resulting 37 to 1 payout netted him nearly $3.2 million, enough to rejuvenate his dreams of starting a su successful business. He threw himself back into his work, eternally thankful for his lucky new lease on life. Five years later, it wasn't Chin that needed saving, but Vegas itself. The hot zone crisis had strangled tourism. Years of ever-increasing heat had dried out the country completely. County completely. Water, in critical demand everywhere, was now too expensive to import. Abandonment seemed to be the only option. The City of Lights was about to go dark forever, but Stanley Chin couldn't let that happen. In five years of incredible success, he had turned $3.2 million into $200 billion, selling water filtration technology that... data corrupted. Dang it, that was a pretty neat story. Okay. Okay. So this was Vegas. Never actually been to Vegas. What is with the holographic looking sea art? So that's where I'm supposed to go, so let's keep exploring a bit. It's because you never know what you might find. Or nothing at all. Okay, that's where I came in. This place is neat looking. Hmm. Yeah, so the Ren Fair was fun. Let's go down. What is bubbly sound? The sounds are interesting to say the least. This is pretty cool being able to just breathe underwater like this. That looks like a way out. The party's down here, somewhere. Gotta find where it's hiding. Yeah, we will. Because we follow the little arrow. So yeah, one of my favorite shows. Whoa. There's no way I can fight that thing underwater. I'll have to be careful. Tide River. What is that? I think I'm good on medicine. All of us are just in the dome. Is pretty. Okay. That must be the red light that Norman saw when the water rushed in. I'm not sure what you're referencing. I guess something over there. Seeing something over here. I gotta find a way to deal with it first. I should take a look at that red line I saw earlier. Wow, there's a current here. Investigate the red light. 
I will. Oh, that red light, okay. There's a serious current going on right in there. Hmm. So I'm probably gonna have to drain this place first, is my guess. I'm activating, but I'm activating it. Critical flooding detected. Automatic drainage controls offline. To execute an emergency purge, manual reset of primary and secondary pump nodes is required. Okay. The purge can then be triggered at the pump maintenance station. We do this purge and drain all the water. I can fight that big machine on dry ground. Hopefully yeah. I have to reset a couple of pump nodes first. According to the map, there should be an access point for the first node south of here. More machines down here. I'll just come around them. Get to cover. Samos. So, yeah, have to be careful. the kelp. Unfortunately, the kelp makes it harder for me to see as well. Raising that part should stop one of its attacks. Yeah, but the problem with breaking that part is we can't do it while we're underwater. Ooh. Okay, so apparently I can't fit. Yes, I can. Just the two at least, that's all I'm seeing. That looks like an access point. The second okay. node should be somewhere below. There must be a whole network of these tunnels down here. Yeah, yeah, there probably is, honestly. Look, you can breathe underwater now. So yeah, one of my favorite attractions at the Renaissance Festival was it was his first time there. It's called the Wheel Walker, and he was pretty cool. He had this big wheel that rotates around. Ooh, data point. Just shut down the secondary node. No more water for the fountains. No more shows. No one left to appreciate Aww. them anyway. I'll never forget the city's grand reopening. The fountains had been bone dry for years. No one believed they'd ever return. So, as the first bloom arced up in the dome, the music swelling, my heart soared right along with it. The city gave me a second chance once. Now it had one, too. The domes, the water. He was responsible for all of it. Maybe that debris is weighing it down. Hmm. Just ignite this. Okay, let's see if that helped. Should. It did. There, one node down. Better swim back up and find the other node. Okay. Now to 
go deal with the creatures again. Getting back up is easier said than done with this thing. According to the map, the maintenance station should be at the south end of the dome. Of the dome. Back there, go quick. Uh, sure, except that you can't shoot underwater, which I find is silly. of his view. Oh, there's one I didn't see that saw me. That's what happened. New data point. Hey, when so text log. Hey, Wendy, I had to leave early today. Could you handle something for me? My custom order for Mr. Tuberville and Family Suite 115 just came in. The receipt makes it very clear that it is not to be sent to his room. He wants the package sent out to Miss Olivia in New Paradise. Yes, that is Olivia, and no, he clearly doesn't know. So don't you go telling him, girl. If she wants to keep squeezing gifts out of these cheats, then good luck to her. I thought maybe she'd finally got too old to reel them in, but Liang said she saw Miss Olivia on Tuesday, and she looked like she was in her early 30s again. So she must have gone back in for more work, and it couldn't have been cheap, that's for sure. Treatment or not, I hope I've still got half her energy when I'm in my 60s. Okay, I have to run. Get that gift sent out to her. Usual drone service. See you Wednesday. Are you quite done trying to watch me? Seriously? You saw me again? I know you're nearby. Oh, you're directly above me. Okay. I do not like you. Just try to get wherever I need to go. This is annoying, to say the least. I'm trying to dodge all the critters. There's plenty of them. It's somewhere this way. There's the access point. Should lead me to the pump node. Okay, the place with the jellyfish coming out, or bubbles, or I honestly am not sure what's coming out. Okay, there we go. So yeah, the wheel walker, he had this giant, like, wheel on one end, weighted thing on the other. It was pretty cool looking. And he basically walked on it and rotated around and did acrobatics and it was pretty damn cool. Luckily he stayed safe because it was drizzly and cold and that metal he was walking on looked very slick. Let's go ahead and ignite this, get it out of the way. But yeah, if you look up the wheel walker, because that's literally what he goes by on all his social media is the wheel walker. Apparently I was still too close. He was pretty cool. There it is. To watch. Oh. 
Okay, I've taken care of both nodes. Now I just need to activate the emergency purge at the maintenance station. So yeah, out of all the shows we went to, that was probably my favorite, was the Wheel Walker. Apparently he's from Florida, is what he said. So if you ever get a chance to go see him, I highly recommend it. Okay, nothing down there. Okay. We're checking out. Okay, back this way, figure out where we're going next. And unfortunately, they all lose their marks when I get out of range, apparently. What is that? It says new. Data corrupted. I understand you want me to come back, and I'm missing Jesse too, but this takes the personal touch. Our competitors can shift 100,000 units of VAT grown in one call. You know the only way we're going to take some of that business is by building relationships. I've got three more appointments tomorrow and a good feeling about the first two. If I land just one of them, it'll be enough to keep the farm going for a few more years. This one chef, he tries to talk, he likes to talk about the way you can taste the differences with real meat. He says it's like homeopathy. Homeopathy? I'm not sure. The texture and composition might be the same, but you can taste the imprint of life. Whatever he's talking about, it seems to sell. And there's a lot of hollow stars at his restaurants. So just a few more days, okay? They say if you want to take a gamble, you come to Vegas. Maybe tomorrow our number comes up. Okay. Interesting. You ain't shooting off any part because we gotta get out of here. Preferably without being seen too badly. interesting looking. Maybe I'm high enough they won't notice me as I go to the red light. Power. Let's look at the console I found earlier. That might be the main station. But how to get in? That is the question. Find an entrance. It's not it. Okay. Yeah, there was a snap mod I didn't have marked, so I gotta be careful. Dune Hollow. It looks like part of the There we go. Collapsed. Yay, entrance. Okay, let's see where this is. Ooh, something purple. Green shine cluster, sweet. Open door. I think I'm in the maintenance station now. I just gotta find a console to activate the emergency purge. We'll get it there. I guarantee they put it in there for us. Let's take some time. Plus, I see stuff we can loot. Loot, loot, loot. Come on. There we go. Plant. Don't know if I'm going the right way or not. I think I am. Looks like it. Maybe. This looks promising. There should be a console in here. Missing. There. I'm going to draw this one Okay. Down. 
then we've got to kill a bunch of critters. So we also participated in the Queen's Tea. Um, interesting. The Queen's Tea was fun. Had snacks and English tea, which I enjoy. My husband's kind of meh on it, but you get a collector pin, like the kind of pin you can put on clothes or something, which is nice. Woot. That did it. <laughs> Sweetness. Okay. I can deal with that machine guarding the door on the other end of the dome. And once I get past it, I can get to yeah. what's going on the other side of the door. Poseidon. New data point. I guess the purge didn't System shutdown zone's there. done. The only thing left is to power everything down at the control center. So, I guess this is it. One final walk down the strip, and then it's lights out forever. At least I won't be around to see it destroyed. The Odyssey will be well on its way to Sirius by the time the swarm gets here. Still, my last memory of this place will be empty. A city that's already dead. Maybe he's not, but I hoping I'm going the right way. Yeah. No, I haven't. Data corrupted. You'll see a recreation of Mono Golfier Brothers Hot Air Balloon. This is the second model of the balloon to grace the Las Vegas Strip after the first one was sold to a casino in Shanghai in 2031. The original Montgolfier's balloon took flight in Paris, France in 1783 and was the first free flight by humans. But the two brave men who jumped aboard weren't the first beings to take to the air. King Louis the 16th had insisted on a test flight that sent a sheep, a duck, and a rooster into the skies three months earlier than their human data corrupted. Las Vegas timeline for Miss Chavez's history class. Interesting. 15,000 BC mammoth woolly elephants come to Nevada before it is called Nevada to eat. 8,000 BC Native Americans come and draw tarot glyphs which are different from pterodactyls. Well, I'd hope so. 1829. Some people from a place called Spain and Europe call Las Vegas Las Vegas, which means the meadows. I did not know that. 1905. The city is made a city and the railroad comes so people can rest and get water. 1931. A big dam called the Hoover Dam is made near Las Vegas. 1946. Benjamin Bugsy Siegel opens a hotel. 1951, big bombs are blown up in the desert. People come to watch the mushroom clouds and our city is called Atomic City. Lots of hotels are builded. Builded. 1956, Elvis Parsley. Parsley, really? Performs in Las Vegas. Okay, it's Elvis Presley and it's performs, not performs. 2007, a big hotel called the Stardust is exploded. I don't think that really happened. I could be wrong. 2030, it gets very hot and the animals die and people say it is too hot and go away. 2035, Stanley Chen is very lucky and wins $3.2 million on a roulette wheel by guessing the numbers. He guessed a number. 2037, people from Nevada and Arizona and California fight against robots when the government tries to make them leave because it's so hot. Almost nobody comes to Las Vegas anymore. 2040, Stanley Chen has used the lucky money and made more from making water that you can drink without getting diseases that make you sick. He pays his money for a big bubble over our city in a hotel called The Fountain. 2047. My school, Stanley Chin Elementary, is open for children. Thank you, Mr. Chin, for everything that you have paid for for our city, where we live, and for stopping it from turning into a desert. You need to go back to school. You are 
not a good teacher. That's putting it nicely, sorry, but it's true. If you, your English is that bad and your teacher, no. Not a lot of hidey holes up in here. I was hoping to get to the top of the building and shoot downward. Looks like maybe I can. Yay! Okay, where's the snap ball? There's that. hear it. There it is. These machines behind. I could sneak by them. Get rid of the big one first. Okay. Ow. Knock off your bits and pieces. Ow. That was not nice, dude. Where are you going? Okay. There's at least one more. There it is. Come on, pop up. Oh shoot, I need to watch my health. How did I miss you? There we go. And that's those three dealt with, Woot. Dang it. I missed my ledge. Okay. Let's get my bits and pieces for killing the critters. My prizes, basically. Uh, yeah, I needed that. that up in case I need it again. Okay. Grab a few of these as I go, because I have a feeling that other oh, critter is going to be a lot harder to kill. I have a feeling he's not going to be happy with me having drained everything. New data point. 3, 10, 64, 13, 24. PC columns. This is the land of the free. How can we be free if we can't even drive our own cars? Smith Richardson Alger 7. As your lawyer, I must remind you that removing the car self-drive automation could lead to... The whole point of this case is to return my fine vintage automobile to its original ORI... G-I-N-A-L condition, that means no robots. Yes, and in our papers, 
This is a piece of history, American history, from where we made things. Do they want all our history to vanish? I'm not sure that the court, oh, I know the court will say, it's just a car, safety must come first, blah, blah, blah. Yes, it is likely that, but that's not what this is about. It's about returning this car to its original, unchained, unbridled American data corrupted. Okay, so he liked his car a lot. Okay, the side is through there. Where did that machine go? That is the question. Aloy, it's a miracle. Oh. No, you guys should not have come down here until I told you it was okay. <laughs> Bad Delvers. Was this you? Did you water the waters? Yeah, but there's a new problem. That thing's in our way. Oh, wow. Yeah, it's gonna be difficult to get the embers with that around. As the scrappy band of adventurers beheld the beast, they knew what they had. I do like that voice. What? Are you crazy? Hush now. She saved our Dell. Okay, and you don't know. Time to put my hands down below. Straighten my elbows out. Stay up here and start firing when I engage. Can't I just sneak up on it? Like I do with everything else? Of course not. No preparation or anything. Let's just, hey, go fight. Joy. Okay, good. At least I start from a sneaky spot. Places, fellas. Get to that overhang. Machines resistant to fire. Expecting that. Um, ow. No, bad idea. Get out of the water. Why? I mean, I'm not too upset at you not moving around, but it is weird. I kind of want the tail. I don't know why, but I really want the tail.
see what you got. Destructible, indestructible, destroyed when killed, he upgrade resource. Keep the perked water pouch. So yeah, I want that tail. I got the tail too. Yay! You did it! Yay! Killed a tide ripper. Have Come I on, get a move on. Okay, what else? Do I have anything else to collect? Let's build this up. anything else. But yay, I killed the Tide Ripper. What about the other things I knocked off? I guess it was just knocked off. You know, grab what we came here for and get out before any more of those things decide to show up. Now, now, shard counter. Nothing wrong with a little reverie. Yep. So we should probably let our flame-haired friend get going. Yep. I believe she has business down here, does she not? Yep. Right. Of course. You need any help? No. Nope. I can handle it from here. Very well. Well, we'll start taking some of the embers upstairs. Holler if you need us. Thanks. I want to see your show, though. Hair is sick with this heat. I hear a tracker burrower. Somewhere. So should be somewhere beyond this door. Time to bring it home. Let's grab these. Oop. Let's go grab Poseidon. Take him home to Gaia. Hmm. How's this so dry in here? When it was lower. Than the water. It should still have water in it, you would think. Okay. Maybe because it was sealed. The sun should be hiding in some kind of processor. I need to find a console to gain access to it. I can't do it. I can't give up on this place. I'm leaving everything on standby. The system's equipped for run for decades, if not hundreds of years. It's a long shot. But maybe someday, hmm. against all odds, yeah. someone will find this place again. Marvel at its lights and wonders. Discover a fortune and boundless opportunity. Make it their own dream. After all, if the city can give me a second chance, if water can flow in the wasteland, anything's possible. He was right. Mm-hmm. Okay, data encrypted. Hidden in the AC code, so someone must have inserted it via thermostat interface. Pretty funny, actually. You know that hollow ad for the caveman review over at the vodka? Well, they're uh, 
loincloths disappeared. Went on for almost an hour before we shut it down. Chuckles aside, we can't let it happen again. I've been over the environmental and hollow systems, and they look okay. On your shift, have a look at the water infiltration code. Hate to think what might happen if those systems were compromised. Would it be a lot worse than a few naked Neanderth it would would be a lot worse than a few naked Neanderthals on the strip. So one thing I'm wanting to do I haven't quite figured out how to do it is figure out a way to hook my Atari up to maybe I'm some sort of capture card to stream Atari games. So I think that could be cool. If not, it'll just be a Otherwise, it'll be a camera a on the back. screen or something. Alpha Prime. Master override activated. Restoring Poseidon subordinate function to original code. Yay. Poseidon captured. Gotta bring this back to Gaia. Is there no quicker way? Apparently not. I mean, yeah, I could. Initiated. Looks like taking Poseidon triggered a restart of the city's power system. Interesting. Rond and crew must have headed back up top. With all the ambos they could carry, I bet. Yeah, you can see some of the things are gone, what they call embers, the holograph. Wow. It's even prettier now. I mean, look at this. It's all in a dome. Nice. It's very pretty. I'm sure I've missed something, but a little late now. Hey, look at the dragon. That's pretty cool looking. Almost full. Huh. Anything that I missed that I can grab right now? Not that I'm seeing it offhand. Oh, this one was definitely dragons. Hop, hop. Hmm. So I gotta figure out how to get higher. get to it. Dang it. Back up the escalator. There we go. Okay. Is it this way? I am so confused as to where I'm going. It's interesting how quickly the sand dried. I have no clue where I'm going right now. Except I need to go up. Okay, so something to do with this, I'm guessing. There we go. Oh, there was a letter right there. Come on. Can't you just up? Seriously. Okay, get up. We'll use the frickin' ladder. And she couldn't just frickin' climb up. Okay. 
So I think I figured out why I've been getting so motion sick so easy lately. Is I think I need to re get, get my glasses redone. So I've noticed a lot of stuff lately has been blurry to me. An elevator. No one must have built this before the place flooded. That's Yay! Nice. Yeah, not to have to climb back up. Yes, it will. So I'm pretty sure that you need new eyeglasses is the reason I've been getting motion sick so quickly lately. So I'm going to make an appointment, hopefully for Monday, get in there and hopefully be able to see a little better. So when things are fuzzy, it's not fun. Never really had to deal with that before. So that's new for me. So where am I going? Exit the rooms. Whatever she did, it must have powered up the whole thing. Yes, it did. How much did all this cost? <laughs> wow. Oh. oh, the show my old gramps always wanted. Pretty. There's another. Oh, that's cool looking. <laughs> His dream realized. His old Gramps legacy ensured. Our hero beheld the sea of desert lights and wept at his good fortune. When I saw the embers as a child, I never dreamed they could be like this. Thank call them members, I call them holographs. Well, did you find me? Potato. Were yes. I did. And now I have to move on. Oh. Oh. Come back when you can. I got big plans for this place. I thought you wanted to put on shows with the embers back in the claim. Oh, no. <laughs> this is the show. Oh, can you imagine? Folks from all over the land coming to take it all in. <laughs> Plus some food and a nice place to stay. Not to mention a variety of entertainment venues. Yeah, don't forget, games of chance. Plenty of shards to be had there for certain. <laughs> Reopening Vegas. Nice. I am. Um, I hope you make it happen. Goodbye, gentlemen. So perfectly in sync. This delve was a story for the ages. All thanks to you. Glad to help. Enjoy reviving Las Vegas. If Moreland and crew is gonna stay, maybe I should come back and check on them later. For now, I need to get Poseidon back to Gaia. But I might want to head back to Silga. See if she needs help with that scrambled signal first. And with my new diving mask, I should be able to swim as deep as I want to. Once I find a place with more water. Okay. Couldn't get in there. Couldn't get in there. So many blocked areas, it's annoying. So I think I'm going to probably stop here. For now, I'll try to get on later. My husband's working all weekend, so I'll have lots of free time, but I want to get some stuff done around the house, too. That, and I didn't really have much for breakfast, so I'm kind of hungry. Ooh, skills. Let's see. That was it. Okay. I'm going to get that finished out and that finished out. So yeah, this is a good stopping point, I think. So this will be Danny Marie 911 signing off. Thanks for watching, live or later, and see you next time. Bye.